Yeah, yeah, what's good everyone? Welcome to my channel. I am a Sage Who Rises. Today, I will be doing the Sun Moon Rising of Scorpio. So, let's get to it. So, angels. So, Scorpio, this is the calm after the chaos, okay? I'm saying that the natural world needs you. But you had three witchy sisters here who wanted you to see yourself as the bottom of the pits. I'm saying that <laughs> the witch of the end of the world there is about to be some shit going on. Okay? And it's so that shit can get the fuck out your energy. I'm saying that, um... Yeah. There's about to give you some shit going on. Just so that shit can be cleared out of your energy. Nothing is gonna happen to you. If you ain't do nothing. But, um, yeah. <laughs> this is the calm after the chaos. The natural world needs you. And you had three witchy sisters who wanted you to feel as though your sensuality wasn't beautiful sorry you being sexy you being confident you being bold outgoing is beautiful okay why is calm after the chaos here yeah page of swords somebody is curious now Mm-hmm. i'm saying that this is the calm after the chaos when it comes to your partnership you could be dealing with a provider okay somebody that is very secure Okay, somebody that is, you know, I also feel like, yeah, this is a storm being over for you and your person. Now you both are being able to provide and have security. Page of Swords, somebody is watching y'all though. Three of Wands at a distance, Two of Wands after the path they chose, Queen of Swords. Yeah, it's like you cut somebody off, now they're stagnant. You set boundaries with somebody, then they stuck. <laughs> Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. So this could be your father. A Virgo? Taurus? Cancer? I really feel as though this is you and your partner. You know, being able to provide for each other. Being able to, you know, have a solid foundation. Full card. This is your new beginning. Two of Swords. And now somebody is wanting to call us Truce. A Queen of Cups. Because they're heartbroken after lying to close out a cycle. Yeah, this could be a Pisces. I'm also saying that this is the end of a cycle. Because somebody partnered up with a Taurus family member here. Hmm, let's see something. Why is this Two of Cups here? Yeah, Two of Pentacles. You and your person could have been going through ups and downs. And now, somebody got to walk away. A king of cups. So this king of cups could be laying some shit to rest. Which is closing out a karmic cycle. And bringing in karmic justice. For you, queen of swords. I'm saying that you could be taking some type of action here. After going through some type of betrayal. That a king of pentacles calls you. Yeah, this king of pentacles is going through sleepless nights and anxiety. Heartbroken. That the will is turning in your favor. This is somebody that's at a distance from you. Who basically tried to charm you. Knight of Pentacles, so that it can slow up some type of finances. Two of Cups from you and your partner. Ten of Cups. Yeah, somebody tried to slow up finances. Remember I told you, the storm is over for you and your partner. Now y'all able to provide for each other. You know, accumulate resources, provide a solid foundation. Somebody was trying to cause imbalances to you and your partner's finances. Now they got to walk away. Yeah, because this King of Cups is laying some shit to rest. This King of Cups could be who you're in a relationship with, or I could be talking to you, masculine. Period. Y'all definitely have a new beginning here with this fool card. So why is the natural world needs you? Why is this here for Scorpio? Yeah, the natural world needs you because you're the empress. <laughs> you are a prime figure. Like, you're somebody that people love. You're very motherly, sensual. Look, sensuality, sensuality. Your sensuality is beautiful. This is the this is the thing right here. I fucking knew it. So somebody doesn't like how beautiful you are. So because you're beautiful, you're a whore. Or because you're handsome, you're a gold digger. Or you out here fucking on hoes. Like, what? Like, come on now. The natural world needs you. Okay? You could be the creator of something. Alright? You're very beautiful, creative, nurturing, compassionate. You know, you bring harmony. 
And with this nine of pentacles, you're independent. You stand alone. And you had somebody out here judging your ass. And the whole time, you were innocent. They was doing this to cause a stalemate for you, Queen of Cups. Because they was heartbroken that something had been laid to rest for them. That something has ended for them. And that they were defeated. So they tried to cause you an imbalance. Yeah, they tried to cause you chaos, destruction, sudden upheaval, trauma. Whoever this Queen of Wands is. And this King of Cups. That you ghosted. They work together. To take an impulsive ass action. To slow up your finances here. Why is the Empress here? Yeah. <laughs> You're leaving motherfuckers out in the cold. And they're watching you. <clears throat> At a distance. After they chose some type of path. You know what I'm saying that? With this Queen of Swords, you could be showing up as in Libra energy. You could be a Scorpio, Libra, um, not Scorpio, Libra, but Libra, Scorpio. You could have a Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, okay? But yeah, the choices you chose is the reason why you have foresight now. It's the reason why you have victory and success in your near future. And somebody is watching you. Like I said, this is a motherfucker that you left out in the cold. They sabotage themselves for what they wish for. Now they had hella regret. Whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, this is a third party. Either a family member or friend. Okay? This bitch took some type of action here. And now they're getting karma. Because that was a bad fucking investment. Why is the Five of Pentacles here with this Empress? I'm also hearing that the natural world needs you. And you could be leaving a Taurus out in the cold. This could be a baby mother of yours. A mother figure. You're leaving this bitch out in the cold. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Yeah, full card. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. This could definitely be a Taurus. Third party, family, or friend. Yeah, this is a fucking Taurus. And their motherfucking lover, who was spying on you at a distance. They chose some type of path when it came to you, Queen of Swords, because you were self-sufficient, independent, and they was out this bitch judging you, trying to attack you. And that's the motherfucking truth. All because you had good news coming towards you. Like I said, Empress, you leaving somebody out, some, you leaving somebody out in the cold. Okay? Because you feel as though they stupid. You feel as though they lack commitment and you want to have a new beginning. Why is these three witchy sisters here? Who is these three witchy sisters? For Scorpio? Death. These three witchy sisters are about to go through an ending. They're about to go through an unexpected upheaval. Because the divine is here for you and your lover when it comes to this Queen of Pentacles third party. They got to walk away from second impulsive ass actions because you've already learned this lesson and you're standing in your power because you know the truth. Yep. I'm saying that this King of Cups ghosted them. Now it's a stalemate. Why is Sewer Mermaid here? Like I said, your sensuality is beautiful. Bitches wanted you to feel like you were some type of dumpster juice because you were beautiful. You was attractive. <laughs> Why is your sensuality is beautiful? Yeah, judgment. Motherfuckers was out here judging you. They were judging you. High priestess. They was judging you, high priestess. But I had the nerve to be jealous and envious of you. Watching you. So motherfuckers was watching you out of jealousy and envy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you was discreet. Because you was a mystery. Page of Cups. Now motherfuckers want to apologize. Ace of Cups and have love for you. Nine of Swords because you overcame some type of dark night of the soul. Ten of Wands that was supposed to cause you a heavy burden. With the Six of Pentacles, somebody thought that they could dish you out some shit. They thought they could block you from your masculine. So they did work. This is a community of people that's been projecting because you moved the fuck on and got victory and success over an illusion that was created through somebody who was doing magic. These are a bunch of charming ass people. They try to date. They try to basically charm you. So somebody was doing magic on somebody who wants to date you. Okay. And it's because they was in competition with you. This bitch is being exposed. That's the truth. Why you get good news? Because somebody from your past is getting bad luck for attacking you. They missed the opportunity. Now they're mentally stuck and trapped. This king of wands wish fulfillment was to cause you some type of loss, grief, despair. Because of this group of people that wanted to betray you and want you to go through some type of imbalance because you was out here healing from an illusion that a family created behind your back, Queen of Cups. Yeah, they wanted you to go through heartbreak. They wanted you to be laid to rest. So they tried to slow up your finances and take action here. But whatever action they took, they're getting karma for that shit because it was a bad investment and it was a bad idea. 
Yeah, Ace of Pentacles to pay somebody. To cause you to go through an ongoing battle. It's like you've already learned from your past phase. And you gather your strength. <laughs> Temperance. And bring balance to a situation or alchemize the energy. Seven of Swords. And it's like whoever this liar is, they just was trying to close out something for you. But you still got victory and success. And now somebody else is going through some type of stagnation. A tower. Whoever this Queen of Wands is, this bitch got to start over. Because she tried to win at all costs, at a distance. And chose this path when it came to you, Queen of Swords. Because you were so sufficient and independent. So this is a bitch that's mad because she got to lay on her back to get money. Well, this is a bitch that's mad because your nigga make money and you make money. Or this is a bitch that's mad because masculine. You work for batter, but you don't want them to do her cheating ass no more. You see, you see this person as a cheater. Oh, well. So, they mad. You could be 44, 25, 32, or 45. Okay? So, yeah. Somebody weird. They weird. So, angels, what we got for Scorpio? We got Emperor, Divine Masculine. Horus or Osiris type of energy. We got Starseed. We have Shine Bright, baby. Because you are a healer. And you can heal the world and yourself. Yep. Water sign. So you could be dealing with a water sign. And you and this person is like the complete opposite. You know. But got a strong bond. And um, the sexual chemistry is off the charts. I'm saying that somebody want to know if they can suck it. Okay. Desperate attempts to get you back. Is it somebody who is reckless and they're worthless? They don't even know they fucking worth. At all. They don't know they worth. This person will resort to sucking diggling just to get you to come back in their life. Like, what type of a bum is that? Why is Emperor here? Divine Masculine. Yeah. Ace of Wands, you're being told to take action. You have a new beginning. You got good news. Nine of Pentacles. And it's because of you being practical, loyal, and responsible. And laying shit to rest that don't sit right with you. I'm saying that somebody wanted you to be heartbroken about them. A Queen of Cups. This could be a Pisces who you had a family with. This bitch was out here creating illusions. Just so that you could heal with them. After they juggled you and betrayed you. This bitch was working with a group of people. Whole time. Why is Starseed? You are a healer. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, you're been told you are a healer. You know? So right now, take time off to heal. Okay? Because you need to relax and rest. Okay? Three of Swords. After going through some type of heartbreak with a Queen of Cups, who you could have a family with, or who you could have been married to. Yeah, this Pisces want to apologize now because they watching you. And, like, for other people... You got two women here. They both are toxic. You got this queen of wands. This bitch got mental health issues. She's watching you. Wanting to apologize to somebody that you married to. A queen of cups. Because she's heartbroken that something has been laid to rest. Yeah, something is backfiring. They're stuck. While you get victory and success. And closing out a cycle with this liar. With this thief. With this scammer. Why is the water sign here? Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Yeah, with the world card. You got success. You accomplished something. You're a whole. You're complete. Nine of Pentacles. And it's like you're independent, successful, financially stable, and secure. <laughs> Queen of Swords. And you also are somebody who's honest, truthful, protective, and independent. It's like double confirmation on the independent. Like you're independent. Just period. You're independent. And the path that somebody chose or the path that you chose has, you know, success coming towards you. Somebody else is defeated. They have to let go. This could be a community of motherfuckers who did some type of work on your masculine for them to block you. And you're still getting what you deserve. It's like, what they thought? Somebody thought they was going to block you so that you could breadcrumb, so that you could be penny pinching. Like, why is complete opposites but strong bond? And sexual chemistry. Why is this here? You have five of swords. This is why somebody has to surrender. <laughs> Three of wands at a distance. Two of wands because somebody chose 
you, Queen of Swords. And it's because you're independent, you're self-sufficient, you're secure, you're a go-getter. You don't depend on nobody for shit. Yeah, it's the end of this cycle of somebody trying to get you breadcrumb to cause you a heavy burden. I'm saying that it's a light at the end of the tunnel. And somebody is giving you love and blocking somebody else. Like, somebody just mad that they couldn't block the love that somebody had for you. It's just that simple. Why is can I suck it? Desperate attempt to get you back. Reckless. Yeah, two of pentacles in reverse. It's just somebody who lacks balance. They could be poor in poverty. And they got some type of financial decisions. What the fuck? So somebody could be trying to suck your diggling for you to give them money. With the star card, I'm saying that you've already healed from an illusion. And that's the truth. Now you're moving on. And somebody could be wanting to communicate with you. This is somebody who sees you as a wish fulfillment. A king of wands. Somebody from your past. Yeah, they see you as somebody that they would get good news with. But you've already made a hell of a heart decision to cut their ass off. Now something is being exposed, some type of conflict that was surrounded by a masculine. Yeah, I'm saying that you've already worked to be in this twin flame connection. Somebody else got to let something go. And that's their karma. So them being let go of is their karma. This could be a community. This community could be let go of for doing work when you're masculine, trying to cause conflict. Now they're being exposed and it's boundaries being set. For what they did in the past or what they continue to do since the past. Oh well. Oh fucking well. Like I said, motherfuckers is desperate. Out here wanting to suck somebody diggly just to get a second chance, babe. If the nigga don't want you, he don't want you. Like, what no don't be don't be Ugh. No way. No way you stooping that low. Yeah, like I said, no way you stooping that low. Yeah, it's like Y'all could have went through ups and downs, but y'all got a new beginning here. Just period. So, angels, what we got to go here? Yeah, seven of cups in reverse. Reality, clarity, sober. Yeah, somebody made some type of bad choices. Now they got lack of options and opportunities. Six of wands. Meanwhile, you're getting public recognition. Page of wands, which is bringing in good news for you. Six of cups. This is somebody from your best. So you got an ex, a king of wands, Aries, Leo, Sage. This motherfucker at a distance from you. And they got to surrender. Because they're blocked. Because you ghosted their ass for a king of cups. And they're heartbroken that you're getting your wish fulfillments. And they're going, and they're being weighed down. Yeah, this is somebody who basically was out here bread coming you. Causing conflict for you. And now that the light is here, they missed the opportunity. Oh fucking well. Why is the seven of cups here in reverse? Mommy? Yeah, what's up, dude? Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Like I was saying. <laughs> Why is the seven of cups in reverse? King of Pentacles. Truth and clarity is being exposed about this Taurus. Or this Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Masculine. And this Queen of Wands, who could be an Aries with the Emperor. Yeah, this is somebody's mother and father. Truth is being revealed about this mother and father. When it comes to you, High Priestess, and how they've been judging you to cause stalemates to your partnership. Because they wanted to cause stagnation for you, Queen of Cups. Mm. Why is recognition here? You got success, victory, winning, having an advantage. Yeah, that's the motherfucking truth. You have an advantage. And it's because you closed out the cycle to your old ways. Just so that you could be in this partnership that was divine. And somebody tried to end it for you. But Archangel Michael is here. I'm also saying that you went through a spiritual transformation in order to be in this divine connection. You're whole. And that's the truth. Yeah. Temperance. You are an earth angel. And you stood, <laughs> you stood in your ground. You stood in your power. It's like you was able to alchemize the energy and still, you know, learn from past failures. And it's like you gathered the strength. Now somebody is about to go through a tower. That's the truth for creating illusions. When it came to you, healer, like I said, you are a star seed. You are a healer. They're getting karma for what they did to you. Why is the page of wands here? You got good news coming towards you. It's going to be swift. It's going to be fast. Yeah. 
It's like somebody is seeing how your reputation is building up and how they're about to lead somebody. Somebody is about to, a Sagittarius and a Taurus here. They ruined, they, they ruined their reputation. Yeah, because you were innocent. This was a toxic-ass couple, okay? They got mental health issues. They were secretly obsessing when it came to you. Very deceptive. It's like this connection, whatever bond that this, this couple had. This is a couple who you were innocent against. And they wanted you to go through poverty. Because they thought that they would get good news. But you were self-sufficient and independent. <laughs> When it came to this father, this baby father, and this baby mother, and this queen of wands, and this king of pentacles. So I'm getting, this is baby mother and baby father. This king of pentacles and this queen of wands, they are baby mother, baby father. They're not husband and wife. They're baby mother and baby father. And they got toxicity. They could be drunk buddies. They do some They do some dark ass shit with each other. They lie or they nitpick with each other. They do something. And they tried to like, pin something on you, but you were um innocent. And they did that to get you left out in the cold. But you bounced back. Now you're independent. Yeah, you have control. You balanced out your masculine and your feminine. And you could be showing up as the Queen of Wands, King of Pentacles. That's the crazy thing about it. You could be somebody that's very energetic. And for my masculine, you could be somebody that's very, you know, you're more of a provider type of energy. You look out for your family. You look out for your women, you know. And it's like somebody tried to like paint a picture about you. Yeah, because this is the six of, I mean, the seven of cups was the first card. Whatever picture they painted, it's not sticking. It don't fit. It's like whatever they tried to do, it don't fit. You outshine whatever illusion they was creating. Like I said, like that's crazy. With the devil, these people was obsessed. Fool card, because you were innocent. Five of pentacles. And they was, you know, fitting up out in the cold. Nine of pentacles. While you were so sufficient, independent. This mother, this father. This could have been a queen of wands and a king of pentacles. So they started projecting on you. To make you miss opportunities for people to reject you. Yeah, they attacked you. And now they're about to receive bad luck. Definitely this Virgo for trying to slow up your finances. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Why is the six of cup here? These are people from your past. Yeah, king of swords, that's the truth. These are people from your motherfucking past who tried to end a spiritual connection you're in. But you was able to heal from an illusion. And that's the truth. Now motherfuckers got to walk away. Yeah, because it was a motherfucker celebrating with this queen of pentacles after she betrayed you because somebody loved you. But you had the inner strength to bounce back and hold back. And it's because motherfuckers was judging you, queen of cups. That they sabotage themselves. Then they mentally stuck and trapped. Because you got good news coming in. Even though motherfuckers sucks impulsive ass actions. To cause you a heavy burden. Something is still being given to you. Yeah somebody was trying to battle you. And now they're being exposed. <laughs> By a queen of swords. Well, you could have exposed this person. That was trying to compete with you. Yeah you. You exposed somebody. You clearly spoke up for yourself. And exposed somebody. Who was in competition with you. And it's because they wanted the same thing that you received. But they felt well. But they felt way down. So they took an impulsive edge action. Thinking they was going to get good news. Now they're mentally stuck and trapped. And stagnant. Yeah. Meanwhile Queen of Cups. You're answering the call. And holding back from people. Places and things. Who's been calling you imbalanced. Because you had to stand in your power so long. Like what the fuck they doing? I know you don't think. I'm about to step out of my element just to address the peasant. Like, ain't nobody about to keep playing with people. Ain't nobody. No. They tried to paint a picture about you and that shit didn't stick and it's like you outshining the motherfucking illusion. Period. It's not working. They really thought it. They really thought it was gonna work though. I mean, give them an E forever, but um, this illusion, it's, they did this because they was drunks. You dealing with a bunch of alcoholics. People that talk shit about you drunk. Like, you a fucking alcoholic, bitch. Make sure you sober first before you start talking shit about somebody. You feel me? You out here spreading lies about somebody and you under the influence. Like, what the fuck? Yeah. I'm saying that somebody is hopeless. That you're being shown as a beauty. Somebody that's very charming, graceful, and kind-hearted. Yeah, somebody is sinking in despair. They're very hurtful that you're being seen as charming. Like, we already seen that, though. Because I was telling you, somebody wanted you to feel like you was dumpster juice because you was, your sensuality was beautiful. Like, so, yeah, divine feminine, twin flame is bluffing. 
Like, you got a twin flame that has been bluffing in your fucking face. Like, hater vibe. Hater. Like, for real. Alright, so what's the tea for Scorpio angels? The tea is somebody is broken. They're shattered, heartbroken, and destroyed. Because this motherfucker was sending you mixed signals. Holding on to the motherfucking past. So it's like somebody... <laughs> Okay, like I said, say like in the past you, we already read this though. So say like in the past you had toxic ways and just out of nowhere you decided to work on yourself to improve yourself and no longer, you no longer have those ways. Somebody is heartbroken that they messed up because they was holding on to the past you and you walked away from their ass. Now they're receiving karma. This is a soulmate of yours that's conflicted. Because they was hoping that you would, I guess, you know. It's crazy because it's like somebody is conflicted. Because you was expecting self-growth, self-focus, and self -fo and soul finding. Meanwhile, somebody else was spying on you. Thinking that they was going to make you their victim. Like, that's why I say, I like... That's why I say you really have to let, like, your plans, you, it's just people plans that they have for people is so crazy. Like, how the fuck you gonna think you gonna be my worst nightmare? So, like, in my life. Like, this is not TV. Like, who is this that's broken, angels? A Taurus. You have a Taurus that's broken. Because they're being exposed. Because you have the power to stand in your strength, to stand in your, you know, whatever. Say, like I said, say like you was toxic. You was this and that. You had the power to stand in your shit. Okay, yeah, I used to be toxic. Yeah, I used to go through ups and downs in life. Yeah, I used to do this, this, this. I used to do that. I used to do this. I used to do that. And somebody is mad that you've already exposed yourself. They're heartbroken that you're not who you used to be in the past. Two of Pentacles, you was able to bounce back and find balance. Four pinnacles and hold back from judgmental ass motherfuckers. Queen of Cups. Like, what the hell? Why is heart fall, kid? Yeah, somebody was giving you mixed signals. They tried to block their emotions. And now they're messed up. Oh, well. Why is heart fall, kid? Yeah, Knight of Swords. This could have been a Gemini. Yeah, they seized the moment. Two of pinnacles to juggle you. Scrimp card. Because you were standing up. To this king of pentacles who was out here judging you, thinking that they could control a situation, this bitch gotta walk away. Because you already know the truth, how somebody was out here creating illusions, because you a healer. And people go to you for guidance. Like, this was this is this is what this is all about. The first card we got right here is Starseed. You're a healer. Again, look at what's here. Somebody already know the truth. How somebody created an illusion because you were a healer and people went to you for guidance. So it's giving chariot. It's like I told you in the first reading, somebody tried to distract you from your purpose so that you could worry about all the noise that around you. Why in the fuck would you worry about what the fuck somebody say about you when you know you have a purpose? You get it? That's why I say people just, people are not bright at all. Like, people are not bright at all. What make you think, oh, because that's what they would do. That's why. That's what they would do. They feel like you are them. That's the whole problem. We're not the same, Pooh. That's what you are. You know? Sometimes it's just people just need to stay in their motherfucking lane. Why is clinging here? Like I said, somebody was holding on, obsessively spying on you. Yeah, this could have been a Scorpio from your past. Or oh, a Pisces. Mm -hmm. Is it somebody from your past that seen you as a wish fulfillment? And you could have been standing up for what you believe in. And you had a king of wands here at a distance from you. You know, trying to get terror readers on you. It's like somebody wanted to believe in an illusion about you. Just because they felt as though they was going to get good news with a queen of wands, their baby mother. So, again, we got now we got the queen of wands and the king of wands popping up. So this is either Aries, Taurus, baby mama, baby father. We, nope, I got Sagittarius, Leo, or Taurus. These are baby mamas, baby fathers. Somebody wanted to believe in an illusion about you so bad, high priestess. That's what it is. This is a baby mother, baby father. 
They seen that you were so sufficient, independent, and that they was in poverty, and that you was having a new beginning. So they was out here obsessing on how they can slow you up. This is the path they chose. And you still came out of it with the Nine of Swords in reverse. Again, that's why I be like, the past that people have for people is just out of this world. Why is memories here? Yeah, somebody is reminiscing, the willing on bittersweet moments. Yeah. Whoever this Taurus is, that you have the strength to overpower, that was causing you imbalances, and you still got victory and success over them, this person was paying motherfuckers. That was a bad investment. Now it's the end of this cycle. They're getting bad karma. This whole family is stuck mentally. And now they want to make investments. They still out here making investments. They still making investments when it comes to doing magic. Still trying to charm you. Still trying to take this action. This group of people are going to be going through losses and regrets. Because this, this is an impulsive ass action to cause you an imbalance. Knowing that something was already given to you. These are people that's in competition with you, Queen of Swords. And it's all because <laughs> you improve yourself. You got stability. You did the work. And you ghosted their ass. Now they're being exposed by you, Queen of Cups, at a distance. You got a King of Wands. This motherfucker want to block you. Wish fulfillment. This is an ex that wants to slow you up because they're obsessed with having a new beginning with you. This is somebody that you left out in the cold. And now that you're self-sufficient so independent from this child's father or this child's mother, Queen of Wands, this bitch is thinking she would get good news by creating illusions about a high priestess. It's not going to work. It's not. So if I was you, I would laugh at people. I wouldn't even give people the satisfaction in my motherfucking life. I would literally laugh at these hoes. Because, first of all, I see everything y'all whole ass is doing. Like, I see you. Now, you retarded. You're not even hidden. Yeah. They made a mistake. Spying on you. Because they're saying how you went through this self-growth, this self-focusing and soul-finding. They was expecting you to be conflicted, a soulmate. <laughs> oh, they're getting karma. And their karma is for you to walk away from their ass and into a solid foundation. This motherfucker is in pain about this bond that you have with somebody. It's causing them stress. It's causing them conflict. Because they was out here being deceptive. Now they're having a breaking point when it comes to you, Divine Feminine. Because they was bluffing the whole time. Your twin flame, who basically was being resistant. Yeah, now they're trapped, stuck, tied down. Oh, fucking well, that ain't your problem. Oh, well, maybe you should come clean next time, honey. It's just like, yeah. Your gratitude got somebody else in denial. Somebody's in denial. He really is. So, God. Yeah. God said somebody was out this bitch judging you. They thought that you was out here by yourself. <laughs> I'm saying that you have high self-esteem. This is why you need to find a humor of a situation. Because somebody is in grief because of your love. And they're in fear, guilt, because of this adversity they created. So somebody is feeling guilty and in fear because of these challenges and these struggles that they cause you. This is somebody that you had love for. Now they're feeling guilty. Mm -hmm. Somebody is in grief. Mm -hmm. Sure is. Oh, fucking well. Don't nobody care. Work through your issues, so like we had to work through ours. Why is judgment here? Like I said, somebody was out here judging you. Yeah, star card, queen of wands, page of pentacles. So somebody was out here judging you because you were shining bright, you was out here looking good, and you was out, yeah, you were shining bright, you were sexy. So somebody came up with a plan to have you feeling mentally stuck and trapped. Somebody's mother or baby mother, okay. And it's because you was official and you was in this partnership that the divine created for you and you had good news coming in for you. So somebody wanted you to go through some type of ups and downs. Yeah, they were spying, but they saw that you had the strength to bring your wish fulfillment in. Now somebody else is being exposed for trying to slip your finances. They want to communicate, but this communication is going to turn into an argument with that eight of wands, five of wands because you're ghosting them. So yeah, it's like they want to communicate, but they don't want to communicate. This is somebody that's want to go back and forth with you. Period. Eight of wands, five of wands. They don't want to communicate. They want to fuss. Because you ghosted their ass. After they tried to judge you for your looks. The star card and the queen of wands, that's judging you. No, we got judgment. 
The star card and the queen of wands that's judging you because of how you look, because of the attention you get, because of your bright ass light. Like, babe, don't hate me. Hate the motherfucking creator. Because, I mean, hey, look now. He created me. You know? Why is loneliness here? It says, I know that I am not alone, but somebody thought you was alone. <laughs> yep. Seven of Wands. I'm saying that um, you was bad already. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying also, the divine is the one who fights your battles. The divine fights your battles. With the Hierophant and the Seven of Wands, this is clearly the divine fighting your battles. <laughs> Definitely when it comes to this happily ever after that you have. Because you are an official empress and somebody just wanted you to be mentally stuck and trapped so they was coming up with these plans to battle you to compete with you because you lost love for them but that's their karma you don't have to fuck with this person you don't have to show love to this person you know god says have love for your neighbors but he ain't say be stupid he ain't say set yourself up he ain't say that at all why is self-esteem here it says i possess gifts of the soul that benefit me and others why is this here yeah, Ace of Pentacles. Your self-esteem is bringing you in money, new abundance, stability, business opportunities, empress. Yeah, and it's because you are official. <laughs> this is your happily ever after that the divine is giving you. And the divine is going is going to fight this battle. Because karmic justice is being served, Queen of Swords. Because you've mastered yourself and somebody tried to cause you a heavy burden. A King of Cups and his family. Yeah, because you had love for your partner or because... <laughs> you and your partner are loved by the divine with that ace of cups y'all are loved by the divine y'all are literally loved by the divine and you have this toxic ass devil energy <laughs> a toys bring a capricorn and toxic energy this bitch is about to go through a tower because you are an earth angel high priestess you was gonna overcome this obstacle that this queen of pentacles put in your path this bitch tried to attack you to end a cycle for you because of your sexiness and your light this bitch wants to you know project slowing up your finances and they're going to be exposed for what they wish for because you have the strength okay it's, you have the strength to get through anything and this bitch knows it she keep watching you knowing that you're going to persevere so she tries something else like, hun, work on yourself. Why is humor here? I choose to focus on the lighter side of life. Why is this here for Scorpio God? Yeah, Ace of Wands. You're being told to take action. Queen of Wands, star card. Because you've already completed a karmic cycle with this ruler of a cult. With the Knight of Swords, this is somebody who is in charge of people that's attacking you. And it's a Queen of Pentacles. You've already overcame this obstacle. And it's because you listen to your intuition. To alchemize the energy of the tower that somebody was trying to bring you. Being toxic. This king of pentacles was in a partnership with someone. And I guess this king of pentacles wanted to partner up with you. Wanted to give you some type of love. But you were standing in your power. And I guess this motherfucker just was in their pride and ego. Trying to basically battle you. Who oh, will? So they came up with this plan to try to have you mentally stuck in trap, Queen of Cups. Yeah, they wanted you to be sick, injured, so that they can control the situation with magic that was supposed to defeat you in the past. Now somebody is crying over spilled milk because they are about to reap what they sow. This couple, and they're going to be in poverty, hardship, because you've ghosted their ass. Yeah, this couple is definitely about to go through poverty and hardship, sickness, scandals, because you ghosted their ass. And lay some shit to rest. Because you've seen that they want up with a bunch of liars and thieves. And that they were trying to delay an ending. For a Pisces. Scorpio. Mm -hmm. Oh well. You got good news coming towards you. And this King of Wands is being exposed by a King of Cups. And that's karma. That's karma. Oh well. Like I said. All this adversity going on. Because somebody feeling guilty. In fear. Of your loving energy. <laughs> like what the fuck? And grief. Feeling sad because you're an honest person. Like babe. You got to take that up with yourself. Sometimes you got to. um Be able to. You know accept the things that you do in life. Like come on man. That's a coward. You sitting out here trying to make yourself seem cool. And look nice. Like that's so fucking stupid. Just accept what you do and move the fuck on. That's how you get karma. Why the fuck would you want to. 
further your karma. That's just dumb. Like, I'm not even playing. That's just dumb. This is really dumb. But yeah, that's all I got for you, Scorpio. If the message resonates, make sure you like, share, subscribe.